Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to quickly use the clone tool in Procreate. I'm using the iPad Pro with the Apple Pencil and the Procreate app. If you're new to Procreate, I also have a video called 25 Procreate Tips and Tricks, which I suggest to watch first because as I draw, I'll be using these shortcut actions. I will link that video below. So here's an image I took. We were recently on a cruise and we were docked on a private island near the Bahamas. Now this water was absolutely stunning. The only thing I wanna do is just get rid of these two buoys over here and probably the ship. So I'm gonna reference this area it, to whatever brush you wanna use. I'm just gonna stick with a soft airbrush. And the closer I zoom in, the smaller this reference circle is. And I'm just gonna reference right here so that I get the exact color on this side. And my brush is pretty small. So let me increase that brush size. So you can see it's referencing everything as it moves. Okay, now here it gets a bit tricky. It's referencing up here and not down here. So if I undo, it's gonna undo the whole thing because I did not let go of my pencil. So let's do that again. And I'm just gonna move that here a little bit. Okay, so now I wanna reference down here. And then we can go on this side. I'll reference on that side. Okay, that does look a bit wonky, so let me just try to fix that. You're gonna have to play around with this. Now, last is the boat. So let's go up here first. Now you kind of want to get it right on. If you do a mistake, just erase. In here, you'll probably want to increase that brush size. Now you can probably see this looks a bit clony. So you wanna go back and forth to make sure that you don't see any patterns that are repeating. And just get rid of that shadow from the boat. So that's a simple way to do it. Of course, I can work on this a lot more just to kind of get rid of this hazy look here, but you get the drift. So hope this tutorial helps and happy photo editing. For more drawing tutorials and gadget reviews, be sure to subscribe to Draw with Marina.